What's up guys, Webstook here and today we have the 5th Avenue 59th Street subway station on the N, R, and W lines. So I'm standing here at 5th Avenue and 59th Street and I don't see the subway entrances here. Where are they? Oh look, it's an Apple store. They must sell apples. One dollar per apple. Interesting. You know, I've bought these fruits and it's almost like they have a lot of known issues with them and the stand over there selling the fruits seems to act like those issues don't exist but if you search them up online everybody has them so uh yeah i wouldn't use that fruit stand over there all right so let's get into the subway station here so if we actually go to 60th street and fifth avenue then we will find where the subway station actually resides. 5th Avenue Station, NRW. This one, if I'm correct, was opened 1919. And that, as of now, if I'm correct, is 101 years ago. Pretty sick stuff. So here's the other entrance, of course. We'll cross, yeah, let's just cross the street. Uh, who cares about setting a good example? Uh, Fifth Avenue Station, NRW. See the other entrance here. Uh, don't jaywalk. <laughs> yeah, there's my good example. Exit northeast corner of 60th Street and Fifth Avenue. Then the other ones go down here. They merge over here and form one staircase that is the exit of the southeast corner of 60th Street and Fifth Avenue get my cards here I put a little bit of extra detail into this booth it's got a accented blue line in it pretty nice pretty nice 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 of course you have another metro card machine there this is the entry for the NR and W here are the turnstiles downtown of Brooklyn NRW let's go to this side first then we're going to come back up the stairs. But I just want to show you guys the announcements because the announcements are over here. So, NRW Lexington Avenue, Queens. Let's head down these stairs. There's a little bit of a passageway because Minecraft, you can't get the exact lengths that you always want when it's at an angle like this. Here are the announcements top to bottom is N, R, and W. This is a Queens bound N Express train. The next stop is Lexington Avenue, 59th Street. Here's the R. This is a Queens bound R train. The next stop is Lexington Avenue, 59th Street. Here is the W. This is a Queens bound W local train. The next stop is Lexington Avenue, 59th Street. All right, so here you have a nice view of the platform. You can see the I-beam pillars are yellow this time, and there are fives indicating Fifth Avenue. I like the detailing that I was able to put into these as well. I think that's cool. The mosaics there. We're going to actually head back up this way, but you can see over there, there is an exit sign, so there's another exit over there. The platform does curve over there at the end as it becomes straight again with 59th Street instead of 60th Street. So again, this is not actually at 5th Avenue and 59th Street. It's a bit of a lie, but uh, who knows why they named it that. I'm thinking 6th Avenue, or no, no, no I'm thinking uh, 60th Street and 5th Avenue for the name. So we go down this staircase and we are here on the downtown in Brooklyn side. Uh, 5th Avenue, 59th Street. And I did not point this out before, so I'll point this out now. There's this really cool curve here. It causes the trains to go super slow, but I think it's cool. When they enter, you can hear them like screeching through the turn as they're coming in. Then they enter in slowly, slowly. Probably about the speed I'm going now in game, actually. They're not that fast here. Got some angled benches. So yeah, they go slowly. Finally, they curve again at this side. They make another curve, and then they stop. And then they can go faster here. Way faster. 
but not much faster. It's only 25. So here you have the other stopper and top to bottom is NRW. This is a Brooklyn bound N express train. The next stop is 57th Street, 7th Avenue. So I'm not going to play all of those because they are just going to the same stop. So it's just going to be the same announcement basically, except it's going to say R or W or W to Whitehall Street. But that's all that really changes there. So you saw this sign here. It was saying exit. We go a little bit to the right here. Exit Central Park South and 59th Street, or more specifically, East 59th Street. In fact, we're going to do some hardcore editing. That's right. Fixed. East 59th Street. All right, so let's head over here. Uptown and Queens, NRW. Again, you see the other side of the curve. Pretty nice stuff. Pretty sick, honestly. Kind of like the curve here, to be honest. It's pretty sick. So we'll head over here and we'll head out to the other side of the station. And we have the cooler exit. So yeah, that's my new design for cage turnstiles. Get a nice look at them there. They might be in the thumbnail, actually. I might use them. We'll go over to the lesser of the two exits. So this one just exit out through a small building. And I believe you can see, yep, pretty awesome over there too. 57th Street on the F. Go watch that tour if you haven't seen it. Then you got this double-sided exit slash entrance sphere. This indicates that there is a subway here. We'll go back down here and we'll go to the other side. We'll run across. Here you can see into Central Park a little bit. You guys know I'm not really doing Central Park, but I just put the trees in for, you know, decoration. You can see the lake over there a little bit. So that is the lake. We can head up here. There's a little bit of foliage blocking, but honestly, I'm going to get rid of it. <laughs> Alright. So. 5th Avenue and 59th Street subway station for the NRW. Pretty cool view with the trees there. I did have the trees in my original one as well. And then you got 5th Avenue, 59th Street, NRW subway station. So yeah, if you guys saw the tour on the previous world, I did actually have the trees. I don't know if you were able to see that, but... Pretty cool. So yeah, guys. That was episode 59. 5th Avenue and 59th Street. On the NRW lines. Hope you guys enjoyed... I'm thinking the next episode will be on the J. I'm honestly thinking of... Here, hear me out. So, I know some of you are going to get mad. Some of you wanted the D-line. And I also wanted to work on Midtown. But hear me out. J-Train has 30 stops. Yeah. And I have a couple of those stops done. A pretty significant amount, honestly. Right? So right now, I have a near-completed... Broadway Junction. Oh, yeah, let me just show you guys this, too. Um, mural there with the animals. So, yeah, I have a nearly completed Broadway Junction. I have Chauncey Street done. I have Halsey Street done from Diamond Axe. Go watch the tour on his channel. I have Gates Avenue, which I just did recently. Diamond Axe did Kazusko Street. And I just did Myrtle Avenue Broadway as well. I have Flushing Avenue... I have Canal Street, I have Bowery, I have Essex Street. I'm going to have Lorimer back, Marcy and Hughes soon. Then I'm going to connect it with the bridge. And then what's really left on the J? The only difficult stops left, right? Hear me out. Chamber Street, Fulton Street, and then Broad Street's not a difficult stop at all. Then other than that, it's just those easier stops that are in Brooklyn. The cool ones with the missing track in the middle. So I'm thinking of focusing on the J and actually trying to complete the J. Because there's about 20 or so stops left, maybe slightly more. But they're local stops. They're easy to do, to be honest. And there's only a few complex ones. So I'm thinking of, uh, as I call it, brute forcing the J. 
which is where I strictly focus on the J as much as possible and try to get the J finished because the J is one of my favorite lines and I'd argue possibly my favorite line. So, yeah, I know I said the D would be next, but you gotta understand it takes a long time to build these lines and the J line I could probably have done in February or before February then have a full ride and I've just been uh, eyeing it and once I started adding in the announcements I was like okay I have to do that I have to do a full ride for that it's just awesome and also for those of you who wanted Broadway Junction I have set up the streets yes I've set up the necessary streets and I could actually build the AC platform now and maybe tour Broadway Junction soon big maybe but it's not too unlikely either because I kind of want to force the J line to be completed a brute force of it and yeah so next episode will be along the J most likely and subscribe if you're new like the video if you enjoyed it leave a comment I'll see you guys later. Peace.